Hello everyone, welcome to another cash stuffing video with me. First of all, I want to say thank you to everyone who um, showed appreciation and support to my last video. with another cash stuffing video and today I am very happy because all our denominations are complete so without further ado let's start where is our here this is for the October 30th to November 15th and as usual we are gonna start with our bills binder so Electricity is getting a thousand and five hundred, so now we have three thousand for electricity. Water bill is getting its usual hundred and fifty, which gives us three hundred. Three hundred. Yes, for leftovers, and <laughs> we have a hundred and twenty. Oh, a hundred and twenty-five. Grocery is gonna get two thousand. I think I haven't explained to you why my meds is in my bills binder. That is because this is being used for my husband's monthly dental um, adjustments because he is wearing braces for the time being and so that is why every time I do a cash stuffing video it will always be something that's gonna be taken out from the meds and that we're gonna get the remaining 220 I'm gonna put this to the side but I'm not gonna put it together with the remaining from the grocery because later on I'm going to show you where the medicine um, leftover bills will go. So meds is getting it's getting 2,500. Food delivery is getting 500. Laundry is also getting 500. We're stacked up on laundry. <laughs> we have like a week of laundry hanging in there. Drinking water has a leftover of 20 peso. I'm just gonna put this here. I'm sorry. I'll just put this coins here so it doesn't disturb whenever I put bills in it. It's getting its usual 100. So that would be all for our bills binder. Moving on with our personal binder. You know what? The last week I had, not last week, but the past few days I have been like reviewing my envelopes. So instead of this being a revolving fund by his and hers, this is gonna be our semi sinking fund, his and hers already said that my husband gets his allowance and stores it in his debit card i am thinking of doing the same for mine i'll just put mine in my debit card as well i'm not gonna put much in these envelopes just because they're just like rainy days for each of us take this out so i have 50 for mine we are both getting 200 today so this is going here. My husband has a leftover of 150. And he is also getting 200. Sorry. So that's 100 and another 100. This goes here. For our birthdays, we are both getting 350. So I have a thousand here. I'm just gonna add one, two hundred. So three. So 
I have 1,350. He's also getting 350, which is going to leave us both an equal amounts of cash. Same. Church is getting its usual 400. So that's 50, 100, 150, 200, 300, 400. This goes here. Christmas, Christmas, y'all. It's, I don't know how many days it is till Christmas, but I'm getting excited for Christmas. And... So far, this envelope is looking good for Noche Buena. Susie is getting 10,000. So we'll take this out. This here. And I'm taking 10,000. So that is 15,000. This is in my personal envelope because Susie, <laughs> I consider Susie a baby of some sort. But yeah, this gets deposited to the bank every end of month. So every month I am reserving 15,000 and whenever I get that amount, I directly deposit this to the bank. Gas is getting no leftovers for gas. Yep, nada. Five hundred. And we are done with our personal binder. Moving on with our thinking funds. Insurance is gonna get. 150 so I'm just gonna add this here wait I'll use I'll use the 50s yeah 150 so insurance now has 200 300 400 50 500 550 600 insurance now has 600 Registration is getting just 800 and I'm also going to use the 50s. So now we have 50, 100, 150, 200, 250, 300 for registration. This is not a new envelope. This was my free spending envelope and as I've said um, the past few days I was browsing through my envelopes and I thought I needed to restructure my envelopes so I used my free spending and changed it to a health envelope because I realized that we don't have a medical buffer. This was the leftover from our medical bill envelope and I am putting it in our health envelope so now we have 500 600 700 800 50 70 we have 870 for our health envelope goes here our debts are going to get is going to get rather is going to get 200 so I'm just gonna use 50s so now we have 500, 600, 50, 750, 850. We have 850 for our debts. I can't wait for Christmas. Oh my goodness, I keep on repeating it, but I can't wait for Christmas. I am excited. Buffer is getting 200. So for buffer, we now have 
1,250. I know this is 100, so it's 1,450. Sometimes, you know, my mind gets clouded whenever I count bills individually. I don't know. I get confused sometimes. <laughs> I'm sorry for that. Travel is getting 500. So travel now has 2,000. And last but not the least, my husband's sister, Wang. She, I am giving her 300, so I'm just gonna get this 500 and put back 200. 1,550, 650. Queenie now has 1,650. it for our sinking funds and moving on with our hundred envelope challenge I hope I don't get the big bills yet but you know whatever it goes I am not looking by the way I am looking at the ceiling trying out my luck Please, yes, I got the 200. So, for the second one, I need to look though because I need to get a yellow envelope. My humble divider over here. to get a yellow well 350 at some point I was nervous I was like please don't be a big amount alternate it needs to be alternate so for the remaining we have 100 200 300 20, 345. So I'm just gonna get one more yellow and I'm gonna put 150 to it. The time frame for this one, I do not have a specific time frame for this one actually. I'm just gonna take my time in filling these envelopes and I am thinking that by the start of next year I'm gonna start with another savings challenge or maybe I'm just gonna get another gallon and make it into a savings challenge but I haven't decided it yet we'll just see how it goes this here I have to count how much I have remaining. So this is. 2,150. Which is gonna go to my savings gallon this is how it looks like now i don't know how to take a video so that it's gonna show you it's here goes to this big filler over here and i'm gonna do that behind the camera because it's gonna take me time again but i want to say thank you everyone for watching and thank you for the support thank you for everyone who comments or likes and views i appreciate all of you deeply deeply i do appreciate all of you you guys are awesome you guys are wonderful and before i forget the remaining goes to the petty cash which is 170
Amigos and here. Okay. Esso goes to the smaller pouch. Here it goes here. And then the 10 peso goes to the bigger pouch. So again, I want to say thank you to all of you for watching. And I hope to see you guys again in my next video. And also Halloween is fast approaching. It's like two or three days. Enjoy your Halloween, guys. And yay for Christmas. Thank you.